So this is, oh, sorry, I didn't say hello. Um, hi guys, welcome or welcome back. Um, so this is WandaVision's moveset for my game, if, like, I ever add her. Oh, ow, oh my god, I hate this so much. <laughs> Anyways, um, I don't know if I'll add her to the game, but, um, because, like, I want to add her, but, it, like, people are going to be like, oh, give her a hex, and I don't want to give her a hex because, like, I genuinely don't want this game to be all, like, all over that pay to win and, like, her hex will disable people's powers and, like, she'd be able to kill people and they wouldn't be able to defend themselves, which I hate people when they do stuff like that. It's, it's annoying. But, um, so this is her moveset. So this is her price first. Okay. So if I ever add her, her price will be 95,000 coins or nine, 950 Robux. What I'm doing is, like, I'm basing it, like, Every 10,000 coins, if I would make a character, like a coin character or a Robux character, every 10,000 coins would mean it would cost 100 um, Robux. So say if something cost 100,000 coins, so that would be 1,000 Robux. But I'm not going to follow that for every character that I do. So if you see something that's like 800 Robux, but the character's only like 30,000 coins, then just know I'm not following it on every character that I do. But... Okay, so that is her price, but okay, let's see. So did I? I don't. Did I? I did I add a shield for her? Okay, yeah, I did. I was like, hmm. So her shield will be called Chaos Shield again, like AOU, AOU's one Chaos Shield. How this works is you will click Q on on like if you click Q, it will just like you have to hold down Q to use it. You can't let go, or you can hold down Q then click Escape on your keyboard or hold down Q and click um, the slash key so it will stay there so you don't have to hold down. So how this works is you will click Q and you will create a chaos shield that has 300 health. Certain characters can counter her shield. Cooldown 10 seconds. So by certain characters, I, I explain this like every time I say um, like counter. Like if you have two characters attacking her shield at once, there's a chance that um, it will break even if it doesn't do like the amount of damage um, that her shield has. So say she has 300 um, health on her shield, but two people use like an ability that does like 50 damage. If they both do it at the same time on the shield, it has a chance to break, even if it has like more health than what the damage is doing. So I kind of want it to be like, you know, something different that you never see in other games. So the telekinesis is, so to use telekinesis, you have to click R on the player. One division will be able to click a play by will be able to grab a player by clicking R. You, you can either throw the player or just drop them normally. If you choose to throw them, it does 50 damage. The cooldown is 8 seconds. So, oh, oh my god, why did it go black? Ooh, ooh, okay, so area choke. If you weren't expecting this, you're dumb. <laughs> One division can choke everyone around her when you click on Z. This will deal 65 damage in total. Cooldown, 10 seconds. So this will be a very good combo character, by the way, just letting you know. So mind erase this isn't like where um she like kills you but mind erase is where one division will be able to make a player forget how to use her abilities for five seconds if you click x on them cooldown is 20 seconds it's just because like i don't want it to be too annoying for people so bolt lock to use this you must click e one division can shoot a bolt at a player once you click e on them it will follow them even if you if they even if they try and dodge it once the like Say if you click E on a player and like they fly away, it will still follow them. I'm wondering if I like I should make it a multiple bolts that do like 15 damage each or something that equals 75. Yet again, I'm not too sure. But once it hits the player, it will deal 75 damage and it will knock them to the ground. Cooldown is five seconds. Um, I genuinely think the cool the cooldown should be like um higher. But if the player is um Say if the player is shielding, um, and they use this, it will also, it will hit the player and damage their shield, but it will also hit the person back, or it will have, like, it will kind of, like, reflect back onto them, so they'll have a chance of getting hit with it, so that is WandaVision's moveset and her price. Let me know, if you have, like, any suggestions for her, um, like, her abilities, her cooldowns, like her damage, her coin price, her Robux price. Let me know in the comments because I want to I make her perfect 
even if I do, do add her, I want her to be perfect. So let me know your suggestions for her and um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.